start this. Alright, this is new cast, and we're here to bring you news, I guess, about video games, but who cares about that shit? <laughs> Do we have news? Who we even plays video games? Ooh, we got an Entok who could join later uh, on Discord, remember? You can just hop in whenever you like. Oh boy. Alright, we got some interesting news. Let's start with the probably only actual bit of news. It's about Ark Survival Evolved. You might have heard about this. Uh, sorry? That even still a thing? <laughs> uh, yes it is, but the problem was with uh, a lawsuit that they were the target of by Trendy Entertainment, I believe. Oh, uh, I and they that. just settled the this one lawsuit. Um, I believe it was about some of the uh, some of the workers at Trendy Entertainment joined the Arc team, and apparently someone like the first. Is <laughs> the first person to move on that team kind of tried to bring other people from the previous company on the new to the new company, which is not really legal, especially since he actually had a clause in his contract that stated that he could not do that Expli explicitly. So, yeah. And apparently they reached a settlement. So do we get to know the details? Uh, Trendy was looking for six hundred million, and apparently what? they said wow. yes. They settled for forty. <laughs> so forty sounds like they don't have it. Um, I mean forty dollars. <laughs> I forgot to mute the fireplace. <laughs> That might have been annoying. I can't actually hear it, but people can. Uh, so yeah, they went from 600 to 40. Well, for a big company, 40 million dollars is not really that much. Uh, the problem is, I guess Trendy was kind of right in this case, you know. Um, I think the clause was... Um, no competition clause or something like that. So yeah, I guess it's it's fine like this. Uh, Trendy is the company develop uh, developing dungeons def dungeon defenders. By the oh. way, yeah. Well, then I understand how they have money. Uh, they sued a Wildcard uh, and Jeremy Stiglitz who is the husband of the person who um, who tried basically to circumvent the thing because oh it's not me it's my husband doing this stuff asking other people that that shit doesn't fly really so yeah I, I guess this is over now they forked over 40 millions and Wildcard is, sorry, uh, Trendy is fine with that. Absolutely nothing. It settled, which is incredible because this was very recent news. Usually these things go on for pff, months. Years even? Um, when they're this big, they usually get settled as fast as they can because everyone wants their money. But still, not this fast. I guess they just saw that they had no leverage for an actual trial and they would have been found guilty anyway, so they just said, okay, we're not giving you 600 millions, that's bonkers, but we'll give you like 40 or something. I don't know how they settled. But in lawyeries. 
Yeah, they probably they probably never talk to each other. To be honest, they probably just it was probably just lawyers lawyering. So, how much is our is your cut? Oh, I get paid this much. Oh, I get paid this much. Hmm. Wanna go for lunch? Sure. Wanna give me 40 million of your clients' money? Sure, whatever. <laughs> Lol. Uh, by the way, um, one of the things they were uh, trying to use as leverage is the new ARC standalone game, if you've seen that. No. Uh, which is a, kind of a PvP thing. Like team versus team. Mm. Uh, I haven't gotten too much oh, that. into it. Did yeah. Someone's it. Mm. Like running around combining like like stones and sticks and shit. Possibly, but I guess that's also Ark's normal gameplay. I know well, the I mean, uh, the well, maximum expert we have. Blah, blah, yeah. Blah, blah. yeah, it's because a bit. Advance with your team, and then when you're ready, stampede all over the other guys or Zerg Rush or oh, wait, stuff that like wasn't that. Team, no, never mind. I I believe it's team based. To be honest, um, not sure. Black Up would probably know more about that since he plays so much Ark. Just saying, the thing I saw on stream was a uh, death match. Mm. Well, maybe there's also death, death match mode. I'm not sure. Uh, I haven't played it. There is a team deathmatch mode, I saw that. So, now, other amazing news. Uh, some about the actual video games, some about things inspired by video games. Uh oh. Okay, I'm just gonna premise this with Japan. Japan. Well, a new Pokemon-inspired lingerie line has been announced. No! Yes. No. 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 Apparently, yes. Yeah, just no. no. The Pokemon company has partnered with Japanese lingerie company Yummy Mart to create I mean, a line of Pokemon-inspired lingerie. Even the, the Pokeball bra is bad enough. I mean, that is kind of cool, but that's bad enough already. So yeah, they're... Uh, the items will go on sale ap April 20, so get ordering, guys. <laughs> now you have my attention, Wait, says Yes. April 20th, yep. So 420? Oh, I did not think of that. I don't think it's a thing in Japan, but still. <laughs> Yeah, probably not. Also, Yummy Mart does not sound like a lingerie company. It sounds like a candy store a or yeah, f food thing. Yeah. <laughs> Quick show pictures. Uh, let's see if I can. There are pictures. Let me. Uh... So this is the stuff. Oh, jeez. <sighs> well, that's not really lingeries. Oh, uh, no, uh, but... Eye eye protector, something like that. The thing you put on your eyes to get sleep. Blindfold? Yeah, that's cool though. I would actually. Uh, kind. I guess. Do you call that blindfold as well? Is it usually no, the ones night that mask. look. Night masks, yeah. A fucking catch you when you sleep. That's awesome. And that's. That's more like a towel. I think. Is that a towel? Probably. Also, Pikachu <laughs> panties. <laughs> Fucking Pikachu cape. Uh, that's the same stuff. 025. 
Is is that Pokemon related? Maybe. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, but those are boxer shorts with Pokeballs on them and possibly in them. Well, not right now. <laughs> Maybe, as yeah. far as I know. Again, the... I, I think it's a towel, really. Pikachu's yeah, pocket number it, yeah, it actually I might. Know. I'm sorry, I don't know I'm the sure all the Pokemon is. numbers. <laughs> yeah, it's one of the first ones, so it might be. Also, I can already see like the fucking advertisement for those shorts. So yeah, or it is like, part like, of uh, the. I just googled it. It it is indeed twenty five. In okay, the okay. On the back, there's also Pikachu spelled out. So, like some some advice. Careful, there might be more balls in those shorts. <laughs> exactly. Like, those shorts contain more balls. Than... Well, that's not a lot of stuff, though. It's not that much. I mean, when you think lingerie, you'd think something sexier, but I guess with Pokemon, it's you're kind of limited. Sure Gotta be family-friendly lingerie. Nice. Yeah, family-friendly lingerie. Holy shit, that fucking cape is like 50 bucks. As I said, it's probably a towel. Nah. It looks fibery. A towel doesn't have a hood. Well, one of those... Some have, actually. I, I used to have one with a hood. I don't know if they have a different name, so... But I would totally pay 15 bucks for that sleeping mask. I totally would. Eh, I guess, probably. Not a cape. Pika Pensu. And that's one of the news from Japan. The other one is apparently uh, there was a survey in Japan about who the sexiest Pokemon is? Sorry, the most yeah. the most handsome. Still as bad. Yeah. So, out of all 722. Uh, it's only five, 500 people who voted, so it's not such a huge survey still. For... <laughs> with a title like the most handsome Pokemon... Out of all of them, I'm surprised they even got to 500. <laughs> Most sexist is Jinx. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no. No, I'll have you know the sexiest is apparently Mewtwo. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, Mewtwo won. The other ones are Lugia, Charizard, Lucario, Suicune, Scyther, Ninetales, Arcanine, Darkrai, Machamp. Gotta get buff. Sizer. Well, okay, I can, I can see I, that. Yeah, Sizer. Garchomp. I can't see that. Yeah. Gar it's a thing with, hu with a huge mouth that, kind of, I don't know, bites down on things. Well, the next one is Garidas, so. Yeah. Oh, geez. Absol, Houndoom, Rayquaza, Groudon, Latius, Firo. And oh. Zoroark. People. That's Dura Fox. This Jinx looks like a human. Well, Matcham kind of looks like a human. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Jinx looks like a blackface he human. Has four arms. That's awesome. Yeah. He also has a cha uh, champion belt. Yeah. That he obviously found in nature somewhere. <laughs> But apparently, the um, lead renderer programmer at ID Software announced that the new Doom will be officially FPS unlocked. Oh! For PC, at least. Some of the comments are, yeah, thanks for this feature. People who care about FPS like... I say ID, you say id, 
whatever. I call I've always called them ID software, whatever. ID software, alright? God damn it. I don't care. I always say it capitalize, so I know what the id is. I'll show you my id. Ooh, we got an Antok here. Yeah, I know to say I waited what uh, opportunity to take. <laughs> <laughs> so like, I heard the beep, I checked, I saw there was an Antok. Are you already throbbing about the FPS unlock of Doom? The FPS unlock? What are we unlocking? I thought they just had a beta this weekend. Yeah, but it announced the FPS will be unlocked for the PC version at least. Oh, for the yeah. So, yeah. I understand that maybe 30 might not be enough. And then maybe. it will be so badly opti optimized that you will never reach even 30 FPS. Exactly. <laughs> But even that, if you, if you reach 60, there's no reason to go over that. None. Yeah, kinda. But I guess it's fine. It's a fine thing to have. I don't see a reason to cap it anyway, but whatever. I guess the most important thing would be to actually have games that run smoothly and run well on most systems. So efficiency, first of all. Listen, it has what's most important in video games. Your character can do the Carlton dance. Destiny has it. It has it. That means it's 11 of 12. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, some games don't exactly um, like uncapped FPS when they like run it triple speed because you have three times FPS. Eh. <laughs> they always exist. They exist. True. That's a thing, That's yeah. Something about John Romero this week. He's attempting to make us his bitches one more time. Mm. One more time. As in, uh, he has made us his bitches once. Has he? Has he really? Who's gonna be a bitch? You're gonna be a bitch. I mean, what? 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 Uh, let's see, what else happened? Uh, I don't see game? any new news about him this week. Uh, what is Oxnar Inc? There is. Oxnar? Oxnar Inc. Something about this. Uh, we had the Battleborn beta this last weekend. I didn't play it, but some guys streamed it. So Looked it might okay. Be... Hmm. Apparently, Oxar Inc. might be John Romero's new game. A source tells us uh, Romero Games is building a new game revolving around this company. I don't well, even know who that is. Yeah. What did he do? I have no idea. No, it's. I guess Wait, it's a don't fake you company. Mean hoaxar? hoaxar. Hoaxar, yeah. Hoaxar, hoaxar. No idea how to pronounce it. As in it's a hoax. It's a uh, it doesn't have a doesn't have an A though. It's just H O X A R. Oh. Uh, Doom and Doom 2 stuff. I, I mean sure. It was just a joke, man. Speaking of, I still need to finish streaming Doom. I'm only no, are, yeah, okay. Doom. But yeah, yeah, it's just oh, there might be a game connected to this website who might be fake, which might be fake. That's really not much of a news. It's just what. Oh, speaking of things that might not be real, did we talk about Red Dead Redemption Two? Oh. The, the map leaked. Leak Supposedly the map leaked. Oh, that. Old so. news. Oh, old news, huh? Yep. Oh, I'm old. Red Dead Redemption 2 map leaked will be a prequel, possibly. <laughs> well, and yeah, it can't be a sequel. The dude is dead. Well, also, the Cowboys only lasted like 40 years, so... 
<laughs> also, his family is dead. So, eh. spoiler alert! Yeah, d come on, dude, it's so old. You've ruined the game for me. Red Dead Redemption <laughs> Two and Mafia Three are the same universe. <laughs> Mafia Three. So yeah, we only got the map leaked, uh, but seems pretty much confirmed. But I think mm -hmm. we already knew it was gonna come out, so. Not much. No we only have the map, which is desert. Oh, I want to give my first impressions of FF9 Steam. They should have announced it beforehand. Yes, that's all I have to say about that. <laughs> they just um, said, "Oh, you know what's uh, funny? I think the the three of us in the in here are streaming it." Uh, no, are we? Well, four, and I don't. So uh, oh, yeah, yeah, the other three of us: Yormas, Janares, and I streamed a little bit of it too. Okay. Oh. Silvia, well, you should stream at very different I times, time. guys. So uh, no, I don't I care. Take... I'm just saying we are. It doesn't matter. Yeah. It's be it's better than Dark Souls Three. I mean, what? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. No, it's not. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's a fun. Yeah, game. it really it's is. It's fine. It's fast and superior. I don't think it's superior to seven. I even I've never played eight. I didn't much care for for it. Also, but... for the record, okay, I'm uh, second place top seller. After Dark Souls 3, so well, I think they did good. The thing is, Octor says it was announced back in December. We all know, but the announcement was uh, was uh, beginning of 2016. There was no release date. Yeah, it said what, this, even the Steam page kept saying early 2016, yeah. and then it came out the other day. Like two days uh, after yeah, Dark Souls, it, it dropped on iOS. They didn't. Uh, they didn't even announce that either. They just. It just showed up, and then they were like, "The Steam version will come later." And then, like three months later, it was like, "Oh, here's this." They just pooped it out. <laughs> to be fair, Square Enix knows every idiot buys everything they push out. And... Sure, but if you give you know at least a bit of warning, more people might care. actually that would, buy that would it. That work. That would require money, and they know people are going to buy it anyways. But who even knows it's out now? Unless you had it already on your wish list or something, or you saw the announcement on Steam, how would you know it's out? There's a lot of people who don't have Steam uh, or don't have it yet that would love to play Final Fantasy IX again. What would I those don't people know? Just for that, they're gonna play the phone version because that's <laughs> cool. <laughs> I already have a phone version. It's called an emulator. <laughs> and it runs perfectly. Yep. I'm just gonna uh, put this out here, but it could be a giant experiment. A sexual experiment. I mean, it's a pretty risky experiment, but hey, they got cash, right? Right, cash guys? They get all the cash without putting in actual work, and that's why I hate them so much. I don't much. know. Oh, if mm. FF15 doesn't sell like 10 bajillion copies, they're oh please, money. you know it will. Yeah, well, <laughs> I know. That's not even a question because people are dumb. Yeah, I want I want to go on a bro trip. Come on, let's. This is the four of us. Let's go. I'm gonna the be. I'm gonna is, be the, myself, the big man. the big gay one, and you can be the little gay one, and then you um could be the skinny gay one. <laughs> as soon as Final Fantasy X hits Steam, should it ever do that, I'm gonna buy it instantly, and I hate myself for it. <laughs> oh yeah, ten. Well, I don't think I would buy it. I have ten, I would. ten two for the PS2, and that still works. I have it for PS2. I have it for Vita. And it, it didn't really have uh, loading times either. So, uh, listen. The most important video game news is Friday the Thirteenth. The game apparently is going to have nudity, so we can get to see titties. You know, get to see pictures tits. The first time I heard about this game, I was kind of hype, but uh, then I heard it's just some some multiplayer thingy, and What's I was like, uh, "What? Friday? Yeah, it's multiplayer. One person plays Jason, the others uh, play dumb teens that try to survive." Oh, I love being a dumb teen. Do you actually you have, have to role play being a dumb teen? I don't know. Like, how uh, does I'm the game guess. actually make I'm you be dumb? The cheerleader. But yeah, that was a point. And I'm gonna gladly be stabbed while having sex with you. <laughs> Neat. 
That was but, the uh, I said, no, I don't want this. Yeah, I was I hoping it was a full game. I didn't actually know that it was like one of those multiplayer games, so that sounds kind of meh. But yeah, exactly. Yeah. It is. I guess, which other way are you going to do uh, Friday the 13th game? Well, there's several movies. As... So there's yeah, several of course there's movies, it. but... Well, you can do it from Jason's perspective. Yeah, well, you'd have guy. to be yeah. Jason, obviously. <laughs> I want to be Jason! Sure, but then it's not scary. There's no... no... Nobody said it's supposed to be scary. I know, but where's the challenge? Where's the game aspect? You're just killing well, guys who can't really defend themselves because you're fucking an immortal anyway. You have to be sneaky. You have to be sneaky. Was he ever you sneaky? You have to be sneaky and, and, and secret and he stuff. He just had teleport power. No. Maybe it's like Left 4 Dead. But with only one special zombie. So I'm gonna eat a lot of pills. Pills here. Pills um, here. We also had what else happened? So apparently, just... there's a new game on Steam about dating older men. Yes. Oh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> are they, are they older birds? No, they're not birds. It's, it's called Puppet Counter. I want tanks. There's a dating tanks. game about tanks. Yeah, there's a there one. Is. There's one on. There's one about dragons. Get that one too. Dragons. Yeah. Different types of dragons, like the emo dragon or the nerdy dragon. Oh, that sounds <laughs> terrible. Yeah, no, that's why it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Is it uh, at least I gotta, good what, art? All right, so so all those games we just talked about, we're all gonna buy for John Fan and make him stream them. <laughs> uh, there was something else that happened that was big news. What was it? Clearly, this is the biggest news. Pub Encounter of Forbidden Romance. Yes, now Pub Steam. Encounter. I, I read the uh, the Steam uh, the description of it because I saw an article about it and it was like, you take a different route home from work after a bad day and you enter this upscale bar with this nice clientele. Then basically you choose an older man to date. Yeah. And get, well, it's get a visual novel. His wrinkled, wrinkled balls. Yeah. What's his five-year plan not to die? <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, the DLC for The Witcher date was released. The Blood and Wine. So supposedly it's the summer. That's neat. The Witcher's good. Yeah. God, Ding the dong. Witcher the Witcher's I good. Ding dong. The Witcher's good. The Witcher's good. The Witcher's good. That's just way too many games. <sighs> One too many. No, nah, it's fine. Uh, I don't think there's anything exciting planned for this summer. Hey, really. Mo. Hello, Mo. Course Party for the 3DS, if you haven't played Course Party on your PlayStation stuff. I've not played any Corpse Party. I, I haven't either, yeah, but I've watched Bad Taste it. stream them. I mean, they're pretty much visual novels with a little bit of gameplay and, like, bad ends. Hmm. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, I've seen Black Ops for anyway, so... Um, okay, so Stardew Valley has now topped a million copies sold. Nice. Two months, two months oh, after launch. Yeah. Wow. Deserved it. Apparently they did. Uh, one, actually, one million seven thousand, says the representative. Dad's for got money Channel in the bank now because he made it all yep. himself. Yeah. Twenty million dollars. Well, to be fair, tax and whatever Steam takes out per copy, so... Yeah, well, he's yeah. uh, still made a shit ton of money. Um, yeah. It's... It's just a formula that always works. <laughs> well, but they do it better than current Harvest Moon, because Harvest well, Moon doesn't have the fucking developers anymore. Yeah, also, the... Harvest Moon is not on PC. Yeah, the new ones, uh, Harvest Moons on 3DS have been... I haven't played them, but I've read the reviews because I always like hope for a good one because I love those games. Well, and so, as I said, the developers are not on board anymore. So. Developers, developers. Yeah, I know, I agree. But this guy, you what? know, he put his love into it. He did a lot of stuff. There's a shit ton going on in the game. He's still updating it, you know, so... Cheers to him. Matt, there is a game that is basically Harvest Moon from the people who made Harvest Moon. I just, again, forgot how it's called. It's called Farvest Foon. No, it has a weird name. 
Okay. Well, there's Rune Factory. Also, Tuna, that's what I just said. I just don't know the name anymore. Um, I'll look into it. So, Damn, uh, I, I couldn't have had more news myself if I actually watched Rocket Beans news this <laughs> week, but I didn't. Because I lose so, names like rat. There's a new trademark being registered registered by Bandai Namco. It's a new oh, Katamari God, Damacy. Ka -na 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 -na. Yeah. Exactly. Amazing Katamari Damacy. Well, well Katamari is awesome. Katamaris are always great. They always do a yeah. great job. It'll yeah. be great. They, they can't really fuck it up unless they, I don't know, like shit on it. I, I really don't know how you can fuck it up. Just make new levels and it's good. Yeah, pretty much. It might be a mobile game or mobile port. Uh, we don't know, we don't know yet. Mobile, don't know, we don't know don't yet. Do we don't know yet. So let's You must cross pay fingers. to roll up this Cosmo. Three fifty. <laughs> Go away, long ass monster! What? We don't have free hoodie. <laughs> Fucking Yorm, I was all happy about it, and then you said the words that make me sad. Yeah. Mobile. We'll see, we'll see. Titanfall um, 2, team the trailer. Bandai Namco's European division picked the amazing Katamari Damacy's domain name, so there might be more to it. Hmm. So. We'll see. I mean, it would seem strange that they pick a whole domain name just for a mobile part or mobile game, so... True, true. Let's cross fingers. As long as we don't cross dicks, I mean, what? Never and cross the streams. dicks! Also, never cross streams. What'll happen? We all know that! <laughs> um, Remember, if someone other asks new... you if you're a god, you say yes. Are you okay? <laughs> Are you guys excited for the new Ghostbusters movie? I'm no. 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 Um, so before I'll, I'll link it to you guys after, or I'll link it in chat too. Um, I know no, this is off topic from video games, but technically it's news. So basically, a guy came online and was like, "Oh, I saw an early copy of the movie. The visual effects weren't done, but the movie's basically done." And he describes the whole movie, and it sounds fucking putrid. But like you know, it's the internet. He's probably lying, right? Yeah. So then the international trailer came out. And it basically had scenes that he described, so it's probably true what he said. So it sounds pretty fucking pure. Possibly true. Then again, with blockbusters nowadays, you can probably guess some of the scenes. So yeah, you know what they already they... killed that movie for me? A the cast. I forgot the na the, the chick's name from uh, Mike and Molly. Molly. Yeah, she I sucks. Have no awesome idea McCarthy. who any of the cast are. Kristen Wiig, so basically the skinny girl in it, uh, the tall skinny one, is the girl in Bridesmaids. If you haven't seen Bridesmaids, it's a really funny movie, actually. She's pretty good. The big black chick plays the big black chick. She's fine, but Melissa McCarthy... No, McCarth she's not. That's the next thing what I, what I wanted to say about what killed the oh, movie from. Hogan's going to be racist now. He doesn't want <laughs> no, Black Ghostbusters. Black that Ghostbusters I matter. No, no, Ernie Hudson no, was the no, best Ghostbuster does. ever. You know the ch black chick's person... The black chick literally is like some some Brooklyn black woman that is poor as fuck. That's just some ticket seller and that is loud as fuck. Well, That's she's it. supposed to play the same part the other guy played, where he's a normal guy who doesn't know any of this shit. But she's not normal. She's just a loud, poor black person. You know, That's you know what's fun? You know what's funny about that part? That part was originally written for Melissa McCarthy, the the fat woman from Mike and Molly. Mm. So that I, part was supposed to be her is. part, and then they, they said, oh, because she got big, like, while that movie was going on, like, she's in a shit ton of stuff now. So they put her into, like, the the the, uh, the Bill Murray role. The only good I thing is, all the original the Ghostbusters that are still alive make cameos in the movie. But yeah, not as themselves. Not, not as themselves. That's not going to make the movie better. Yeah. I mean, no, maybe a little but, bit, but not good. Well, everyone loves money. I'm not gonna go to they're gonna pay the, there's gonna they're gonna be paid a shit than just to be there for a cameo, so <laughs> sure. Yeah, I'm not cares. so sure about that actually. I'm Sorry. just tentatively uh, hopeful for it. I'm not gonna see it. I'm not gonna see it in theaters anyway. No, I'll wait for it to come on TV one day for free and then hate myself for watching it. Exactly. Yeah. Like Dragon Ball. Like, oh my god, that movie was fucking putrid. It's uh, not even worth the time you, you, you invested in it. 
Going back to video games. Yeah, yeah. Let's go back to video games. Video games! (laughs) So, um, the Dark Souls 3 DLC has been kind of announced. Uh, We don't know the actual date, but we know it's going to launch in this fall. Well, chat, rev up your vengeance. We're going to see more Dark Souls on V2. (laughs) Well, (laughs) it's a long way away. It's like six months away at least. Yeah, but the way Kudu's going through it, he'll still be playing it, and then you guys will be back to it. So the Dark Souls will never (laughs) stop. You know what I'm hyped about? This is the first Dark Souls I've ever streamed, man. Listen, I'm not shitting it. I'm just giving. I'm just making a joke. To be honest, the dark. It looks like a good game. It looks like everyone's having fun. And I always tell the streamer, like, play whatever game that you want to play. Because if you're not having fun, no one's having fun. <laughs> if you're making yourself play some game you hate that everyone loves. And I remember, it's never. It, it will never be as bad as when Metal Gear Five came out. Mm, and uh, th- like I streamed Final Fantasy VII: Dirge of Cerberus, which I hated from the very beginning. <laughs> Because I mean, you didn't I, you, play it with a mouse. I don't know why you did that to yourself, but... I don't know, I it was it... like the very first thing I streamed officially on V2. Hey, I like that game. Yeah, exactly. Everyone was like, oh, this is so nice. So I kept playing it. And I was, I, it, it that's, because you played so with, like, that's because you played with a mouse cutscene. and keyboard. In the huge ass cuts, and they took out my 3DS and played Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> Dude, I had the PS2 version of that game. It was not good. I yeah, it too. was PS2. That's why I said mouse and keyboard. You have to connect them to the PS2. It still is a bad game. Yeah, it's fine. It's a bad Final Fantasy game, sure. Well, that... that but that's most no not mainline Final bad. Fantasy games are bad, and some mainline Final Fantasy games are bad. Bad as well. Final Fantasy thirteen. <coughs> yes, thirteen is just terrible. Oh. Listen, lightning is a model now, so you fucking watch your dirty whore mouth. No. Model. I don't know if you guys yeah. saw that. They actually a real clothing line is using her as a model. Yeah, I saw. Well, it's that. Japan. They, we we just saw they have a um, clothing Was it line Japan? from Pokemon. Like they have lingerie for Pokemon. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna wear my fucking Pikachu bra around and be all sexified. <laughs> Three days, man. <sighs> so I wish I would remember any news from from the Rocket Beans news. I'm going through the news right now. I mean, we talked about Battleborn. I, well, we didn't really talk about it. I don't even know no, what Battleborn is. Battle. I mean, Battleborn no. is that new type of game that's basically, it's an FPS, but it's a MOBA at the same time. So it works yes. like a MOBA, but it's you like, play uh, an FPS. Kind of Smite, like Smite. Yeah. I mean, I, I'd rather, if like if you're going to play those games, I find those games more exciting because it's not just click, 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 click. So... Yeah, yeah, possibly. Sl- Slime Rancher had an update. If you guys have played Slime yeah, Rancher, it's the small cute update. game where you they ranch added slimes. a new area. Uh, I haven't played a new you... area yet. I'm, I'm waiting a bit more. It never sounded appealing to me to raise slimes. But they're so cute. Uh, so what happy else flopping around. Had quantum quantum the Break. Came slimes are not thing? cute. Yeah, Quantum Break came, up, came out the 5th, mm-hmm. actually. Yeah, they just said, so they just released a couple days ago, like, we know there's problems, we're going to try to fix them. Game's getting okay reviews, it's yeah. not getting great Ten reviews, but it's not. It's, it's okay. Basically, when it when it works, it's fine, but the PC version is putrid, and the Xbox One version has some issues, I guess. I don't know, it's the, it's the same thing with Batman Arkham Knight, that they never came out on PC because it was broken. Yeah. Yeah. I never had problems, I'm never tired to say that over and over again. Well, the majority of people apparently did. Yeah. What are we talking about? Batman, Batman Arkham Knight. Arkham Knight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How it was broken on PC, and then instead of fixing it, they were just like, nope, see you later. Well, yeah. they did fix it. It just took half a year. I thought oh, they, fixed? They, they, they fixed it, and then it still was broken, so then they just took it off. Uh, and then they put it back on, and it was still broken. And they you, no, you might be right, Hogan. I just remember and, it got yeah, it got fixed. Then they took it off, and then I didn't know if they actually put it back on. No, they put it, it, it back off too, on, and it's it. still busted for a lot of people. And busted makes me feel Hogan, good. Obviously. Well, it's still on Steam. 
Busted. Last two reviews. <laughs> Uh, other upcoming stuff. Um, Bravely Second just came out, actually. Yeah, just uh, Bravely just Second. Uh, well, Bravely Second and Layer, actually. It's Which two, but yeah, that's the that title of it. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure about it. It just came out in the US, right? Because I think. Uh, yes, it did. EU... I don't know if it came out in UK, EU. I have a friend who was already playing it, so I'm pretty sure it came out. Earlier than that, in a the friend, EU. huh? Yeah, but you have a friend. Well, yeah, sorry, she's an ex, so. Oh, <laughs> so sorry, oh. what are you talking about? Uh, Bravely Second. Oh, okay. I'm still okay, waiting for the. Chintendo, your Fire favorite. Emblem. Fire Emblem, Emblem is great. What about it? Speaking yeah, of the really... new one, the Fates. It yeah, what come about out. it? Oh, it, it hasn't come, come out, out in EU yet. Yeah, yeah I, I got it. It's great. Uh, when really is that going to come out? It edition. comes out in uh, May, I think, for you guys. 20th. April, April or May for EU. I don't know why it came out so far after US, but it, 20th it of May. Out. 20th of May. So there we go. Hogan's and I better. really want a special edition. But retailer told me Nintendo is being an asshole and don't tell retailers how many they get. That's just what yeah, they really... right? Yeah, yeah, I had to I had to pre-order it the day it came out to get the special edition. So I have the special. Didn't edition, they remove if, some? Fe didn't they remove some features for the version that are outside? Uh, yeah. So what they removed is basically you in your uh, your units like little house thing like in the base, you mm -hmm. can invite people there. So they, that's still there, but like. Uh, and it brings your affinity with that person up. Like it's a, it's so you actually don't even need it because you can just bring your affinity up in battle with them. But like it just lets you add extra. So they come and they talk to you, and then in the Japanese version you would pet them. So oh boy, I, yeah, yeah. So I kind don't know like why that's weird. Like it, it is games. weird, but it's not like I, I didn't find it sexual like i guess you could make it sexual but that's besides the point so you pet I them you pet them for a while and then like you get the meter up and then the affinity would go up so they just took that part out and then just the person comes and visits you says the dialogue and the affinity goes up so you don't pet them that's it that's bullshit. to be honest i i'm not gonna miss it yeah i mean but, i don't yeah. see why they took it out but at the same time it has no effect on the game so whatever yeah, yeah but, but, it, but it's, the, the thing is that they 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 Remove it to ponder to the stupid people you know, that are offended by something. Yeah, I don't know. P everyone gets offended, so it's easier just to remove shit. Thanks, yeah. America. Well, well that's yeah, always well, been the I'm case, really, with edition. localization. Heavy petting, yes. It's Body not the first it. time it's happened, and it's not the last time it will happen, so... Yeah, they did it in Bravely Second, actually. One of the outfits was too sexy, yeah. so they made it less oh, sexy. Please. And one of the outfits, this was actually... It, it, this was actually somewhat actually offensive was like a native american and they call it like indian and basically it was just like the generic like this is an indian like that's it's kind of racist actually so they changed it to like right. western cowboy or something so, how how dressing up a character in the outfit is racist racism is like hate against well something. if i dressed up as a black guy by painting myself black wearing i love watermelon t-shirt people would probably take that as racist <laughs> no that's stereotype and making fun of it yeah. Racism is hatred against race. Okay, it makes I'm them feel sure bad. So, wrong, but whatever. I guess it makes some people feel bad. Whatever. It, right? it makes people feel bad about like you know you lump them in like everyone's like that. So it's like this you know. Well, stereotypes say, oh, exist for a reason. Even yeah, about maybe I, yeah. maybe about I, all of us. Maybe I have different view of that, those things because we don't have that kind of problems around here. So maybe that's why yeah, it's it's differently. You're all... Yeah, like, White people if, if I see a black person down. around here in Italy, it's not going to be any kind of African-American guy. There's probably people from Morocco. It's like, they share nothing with your black people, kind of. Yeah, so it's the same it's thing, like, with they, they made them the generic the Native American, and there's so many different tribes who do all different shit. So, yeah, I can, like, they did to me, they didn't need to take it out, but, like, I see why they took it out. The thing is, so. uh, you want to do something that's kind of based about that thing and you want to make it generally recognizable. What are you going to yeah. use? Some stuff based on a single tribe that nobody fucking knows and nobody knows what it is? Or are you going to use the widely recognized no, feathered I, I, hair piece? I, I, like... I get it. I'm just saying. that's. I can see why they took it out. But it's the I same thing too. Like 
when, when the characters, because Japan is weird about little girls are like twelve, and they just they just change the name to the the number of their age, like yeah. sixteen. I'm mean, totally. It's 18. like no, oh, it's it's not as weird now because Japan likes little girls. Bro, but she's a thousand years old, bro. <laughs> uh, she is ninety percent. I like the thing, like in Xenoblade Chronicles X, they, they, this one character does like 13, I think. Yeah. And they, they, they said they're going to change it. Yeah, she's going to be 18 in the no, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. in the next release. No, nope, they kept her, kept her 13. She's 13. Yeah. They didn't cave in. And what happened? She's Nothing. not really sexualized. She has a bathing suit like everyone else, but yeah. it's like, yeah. uh, and, it's not yeah, a but my point is even. Yeah, but my point is they didn't give in. They didn't change it. And what happened? Nothing happened. Everything is fine. Nothing happened. I guess That's the thing. 90% of what white, white people think is racist. The people Everyone. that are actually like talked about don't give a single shit. All right, it's just all right. being over hysteric. Ass racist. What? That's racist. No, it's Everything not. As a white person, I'm offended. <laughs> Hey, you Whoa. were you were white and you were in deadlocks. That's racist. As a gay robot <laughs> out of space, I'm offended. Uh, Let's move on. Hey, we are super diverse. Most most people here in this conversation come from different countries. I am Even a gay continents. robot from outer space. Yeah, we're all white <gasps> males. Or cis scum or whatever the fuck it is. I don't get White male doesn't mean jargon. anything in my country. Most people are same white. Here. In Soviet like, Russia, it's, it's not a, it's a, there is no oh you're white so you must be ashamed of something. What we didn't have slavery or anything. It's just if, you, if I see a black person, he's probably come from Morocco. There aren't that many. If he speaks Italian, oh cool. I guess his parents uh, have lived there for a long time. It's, be right back, my it's pizza just is done. Not an issue. Oh, neat. We got, uh, you know what else we got for news? I don't know if we talked about this. Was the Umbrella Corpse comes out June 21st. We, yeah, we have oh. actually talked about that last time. Yeah, I saw that it's 10 days old, but just in case we didn't. The Umbrella what? It's basically Resident Evil 4v4 uh, online game. It's gonna. It's called Umbrella Corpse. Yeah. Remember the one they tried to make before that shit the bed that was sort of like that? Where it was like the you played as the Umbrella Corps and it's like that, but like they're trying to make it good this time. We'll see how it goes. Like that, but good. Yeah, not shitty. Uh, Gears of War four re reveal. So surprise, they, they fight more oh fucking ugly ass Earth aliens. They still like get Gears of War games over here. Where is my wife? Him. So I, I think he's dead in this <laughs> one, or it's set in the future. It's not Marcus Phoenix anymore. It's some girl, some grill. Well, pondering. <laughs> Next week. It's all about culturing, baby. So this week, Sick. Star Fox Zero comes out. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, sorry. You know First why I don't care point, about this? Finally, a reason to own we shitty gimmick shit. Yeah, I don't like, yeah. the, like that there's not an option to switch. You have to use the gamepad. Like, oh, if man. that was there, I'm okay with that. But if you could just use the controller, I'd prefer that. Yeah, and that's yeah, why possibly. I'm not going to get it. Fuck this shit. Yeah, but I don't know. Apparently, uh, all the early reviews are saying it's pretty good. Yeah, it might no, be, I mean, but it's, I'm not. It's Star Fox 64, oh, by the way, but with better graphics. I'm totally, I'm totally streaming it on Friday, so... All right. Guess that. <laughs> When it comes out, I'm gonna stream right. Slippy defending Grippy's yeah. uh, Grippy, Grippy's, Grippy's compound. fucking metal. I got, I need my metal, Slippy. <laughs> that fucking <laughs> stupid tower defense game they slapped on. Oh man. Oh uh, yeah. Well, it's free. Oh, the no, it's Lord. part of it. Well, it yeah, it's, was, it's bundled together. It was a tech demo, and then they were like, oh, people like this tech demo. Let's make it a game. And then they were like, this isn't gonna fly. And then they were like, let's just slap it on the Star Fox. <laughs> We'll use everyone's favorite character, Slippy. No. Slippy's dad. Whoa! Please die. Fox, get this guy <laughs> off my uncle. I, don't I am remember. Off my uncle. I am curious. I what, uh, I'm curious what Platinum did to it. You know, so Platinum hasn't uh, fucked up in a while, so maybe it'll yeah. be good. I can't wait for the Ninja Turtles game that comes out in like two or three May. months. Yeah. Mutants in Manhattan. Yeah, that's really uh, actually it comes out next month. 
Yeah, I'm, stream man. I'm streaming May uh, their Transformers game, and it's pretty sick. It's pretty awesome. Same day as Overwatch. Oh, and, no. Mirror's Edge, and Mirror's Edge Catalyst and Total War Warhammer. I'm, Nobody's I'm not going playing to Overwatch play. Unless they take out all the sexy poses. That's Wow, me. that day is. Oh, man. White Raphael has a. <laughs> Donatel has the sexiest poses. <laughs> that turtle ass. <laughs> <laughs> How can you so even what were you see saying? What, what comes out that day now that we're done interrupting you? So we got uh, Overwatch, we got uh, Overwatch, Mirror's Turtles. Edge, Catalyst, and Total War Warhammer. Oh, so I can big be a titles, tiny actually. Too? Yes. Nobody should play Warhammer. I mean, nobody should even buy. Nobody it. can play Warhammer. <laughs> it's dead. <laughs> Still. To make a point, nobody should even buy this because you know it's not. But it's cool. not. It's not released by hey, Games Workshop. If you order, you get this race, and if you don't, they still profit yeah. off it. Mm, not really. Uh, they just yes, they just really. sell they the like licensing. They don't get anything. Oh, out of it. Really? What are, are they gonna sell their their Warhammer really? Fantasy miniatures now for the game that doesn't exist anymore? <laughs> yeah, it's all about Space Marines now. Yeah. <laughs> Best Marines. It, it, it exists Best as long Marine. as it exists in people's heads. Yeah. It. it exists in my heart. <laughs> yeah, if people still play it, it still exists. It has been wiped from all existence, so it's still around, just not... They're not producing it. It's not, it's not yeah, hot they, anymore. There's no, there's no uh, like, new Well, they literally cannot make it. any more money out of it. Anything that you can still buy has already... is already out there, has already been produced. They're not... They, people have already paid for it. No. And so they're not making any money. Actually, they would want to discourage that. And it's going to be called War Pickaxe. What? Still, so many no. people play it and probably still play it. Not as many as you'd think, but yeah. Well, maybe, of course, maybe in major like cities. Cool. Major yeah. cities, maybe. It's All like ultimate, ultimate Neckbeard, Grognard. Oh, yeah, man. you need to find. <laughs> it, you need to find a lot of people who still want to play it. What you need to do is not wash yourself hard. for a month, <laughs> and then go to the closest <laughs> hobby store, and in the dark, darkest corner of it, you will find. But yeah, I think gym. the thing also is there's just so many like, other Warhammer cool Fantasy <laughs> tabletops. There's so yeah. many other cool games with with cooler uh, figures and stuff. Sure, but yeah, that, uh, I, I still like the Warhammer, you know, lore and... Setting. Yeah, I'm just saying yeah. people might be playing with cooler miniatures. Speaking sure. of tabletop, did any of you have or get the uh, tabletop simulator that was on sale this week? Have it. I did not. I have it I know for like a year. I know Herp has it, so not basically... Long. I'm thinking about doing some board games for V2, so we can do some stuff. Oh, yeah. Board games! You better do it at a time where I can join. We can do that. I'm, I, we just gotta figure out what to play. I, I mean, I, li I like that game that Herb's been playing, but I'm tired of it. Like that Eldritch Horror, or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know. It's like mm. fucking Cthulhu fu fucks oh, your ass goodness. or something. What Arkham... <laughs> Isn't that just kind of the premise of uh, Cthulhu Arkham Horror? Just, oh man, tentacle yeah. up your ass. But, you I mean, there's crazy. all sorts of games. You can play, like, the reason why I thought of it, like, they have some Warhammer stuff, they have some, like, Star Wars, like, miniature stuff, they got, like, Monopoly, mm. like, generic board games, they got, you know, they got everything. So I was like, well, for ten bucks and I can play all these games, I'm in. You know how I just said I probably bought it a year ago? You Did you buy it exactly a year ago today? Game purchase 26th May 2014. Oh, two years. Yeah, I already have it two years, uh. and I played 43 minutes. <laughs> <sighs> Those that was a worthy purchase. Totally. Table so it's tabletop simulator. Is that what it is? Yeah. yeah. So basically, yeah, okay. it's uh, no, it comes with a bunch of, All right. yeah, it comes with a bunch of generic games in it. But like, if you look in the workshop, people have made like any board game you can fucking think of. Um, like I saw, I saw, like, I saw Stratego in there, and like just fucking like awesome shit. I wanted Does to play have Omega, right? So I, I didn't play it anymore. Omega virus. I did not see that one. It's more like so. It's more what like fav favorite board games that you've seen, but then like a bunch of like really niche ones that like people that like are nerds like created. He said like, niche. The... Oh, he said niche. Kill the witch. <laughs> Burn <laughs> it. Oh, 
Also, Sons. if you have uh, Games for what Gold, Sunset Overdrive is available on Xbox One, so you can get it. I just downloaded it. That so cool neat. game that nobody plays. Yeah, what pretty much everyone was like, this game's awesome. But Hell is that? that? Pick up bananas, pick up sticks. Nobody has the one. Don't be silly. But uh, I want to get you guys pumped for a September release, so hear me out. In September for the 3DS, there's Sonic Boom, Fire and Ice. <laughs> Oh, oh man! Oh, I mean, the first game was so good. This game has to be even better. <laughs> it's so good. It, 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 well, it, it certainly can't be worse. <laughs> why? Why are they doing this? Like, didn't they lose money on the first one? They had to have lost money. I, even uh, I, I think you underestimate the, the amount of Sonic Furries? fans. <laughs> well, same thing, really. I just but remember kinda... when Sonic. When Sonic Boom came that. out, there was this there was this guy who posted the story online. So basically he works with developmentally disabled people. And this this kid he worked with, you know, he's like an older, like 19, 20. I mean, but he's still disabled, so he's helping him. He works with him. And he was so excited because he loves Sonic and he was telling him, like, don't buy it, don't get it. It's bit, it's not worth it. He was telling him the game was bad. Kid got Sonic Boom and basically got 30 minutes into it and it like ruined his like like month because the little developmentally disabled kid like it was such a bad game and that's the metaphor of a sonic bomb <laughs> <laughs> it ruins slow people's lives i'm so Pretty hyped much. about sonic coaster anybody so, else they're wasting money on new sonic boom but they want to release uh, fantasy star online 2 outside japan <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> What were you saying? The plant. What is Planet Coaster? You were streaming it last night. I don't. You were just like making roller coasters. Is it Roller Coaster Tycoon in space? No, it's Roller Coaster Tycoon by the people of Roller Coaster Tycoon, which is not the case at Roller Coaster Tycoon World, which is also coming out. But it's bad. But it's bad. It's ba it's so bad. So yeah, it's like a theme park uh, simulator thingy. Like roller coaster tycoon, just in really cool. I mean, if you, you watch, you saw what I could do with just a little bit. Can I you mean, make the roller coaster just... hit the people in your park? No, the roller coaster was the worst. And I don't want it. But like, <laughs> you, you saw it. Those, those, those. I don't want to say cool, but those very detailed. Let's call it detailed buildings. I had that was just. Yeah, just a I, shot. I saw you. I saw you spend like 30 minutes building toilets or something, right? Um, no, I, I don't think. I think the toilets I built before I started streaming, but. Yeah. What? What? <laughs> so... Well, you, you, can, you know, you have. You put in a shop and then you take walls and shit and build it out and do stuff. And oh, cool. I, I wish I had talent to program. I just thought up the greatest game ever. It'd be called no, Shitting I did. Them. So no, basically, I you have get, the you best get game. To the toilet, and you can't get off the toilet, but you have no toilet paper, so you got to somehow get the toilet paper to you. Uh, I have that an actual good like, game that, idea. That sounds like me this morning. No, mine is better. <laughs> it's Detective Dracula. <laughs> Dr. Acula? Not Doctor, Detective Dracula. So God what are you it. detecting? You're, you're, you're undead and you live forever. Fuck other people. Dracula, private dick. But that's the fun dick. part. Oh no, a stream of water. How will I cross it? <laughs> <laughs> but Anton, I... someone, someone already made that game called Don't Shit Your Pants, True Survival Horror. Yeah. <laughs> really? That's a game? <laughs> you yeah. don't know Don't Shit Your Pants? Go I mean, play it I now, know man. It in real life. I heard the title, but I don't know. Didn't see the game itself. Game it's like it's YouTube like a shitty, stuff. it's like a shitty text-based game, like Zork or something. And you're oh, I have seen, Okay, I do have seen. Yeah, you have to shit your pants. Yeah, yeah. Take off pants. Really shit your pants. Congratulations, Take off you haven't shit your pants. <laughs> I have a very good game idea, but nah, I, I can't do well, shit, so hmm. it's gonna rot in my head. Well, my parkour zombie game got stolen, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Did, they did. They did release a Polish uh, fucking DLC for Dying Light. It's called okay. like the, the. It's called like the Bozak incident or something. Bozak, <laughs> isn't that your name? Yes, yes, that sure is my last name. <laughs> that that's that why was the joke. That's why I know about it because I don't own Dying Light. I don't really care about fucking Dying Light. 
I Wait, tried is that the actual name? For a few hours. Or were yeah, you but kidding? it's spelled with a Z. Oh, I'm not okay. kidding. I thought you were kidding. Nope, it's real. Wow. Oh. Are people still playing Dying Light? Yeah, I, I think tried so. It. I mean, it didn't look like an awful game. It just looked sort of like you beat it and you're done with it. Yeah, it's pretty mm. fun when you play it. I played only a few hours in one day and deleted it right away. Yeah, but you have horrible taste. Amazing. Well, we all have horrible tastes, guys. Yeah. I haven't. Oh, uh, all your opinions are stupid. Well, mine is right. Why don't you share it, idiots? But anyway, uh, let's read all the upcoming release for well next month. Upcoming now. games. Upcoming games. As all you said, Battleborn on May the third. Yeah. Then week yeah. after that, Uncharted Four: A Thief's End. Boy, I wish I actually owned a PS4 for that one. I actually do want. I I like the Uncharted series. I mean, one is kind of boring, but the other games after it are better. Like one isn't bad. It's like a dumbed down Tomb Raider, but the well, other it's one's a brick, uh, it's a pretty big Just get someone to gift it to you. Uh, PS4. Hey, please I... give me a PS4. I do like have three hundred dollars extra. The, my sister here. gave me that. My sister I, gave me that for Christmas. It's just on PS4 though. V2 is technically a religion for tax reasons. I stopped playing uh, Uncharted <clears throat> when I saw that uh, Subway sandwiches commercial. <laughs> what? You didn't see it? No. Does he like no, sweet I'm not sure I want to see. Then again, uh, <clears throat> I mean, Metal Gear had a car commercial just now, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just to... Copy that. Oh my god. Um. All right. So we'll go, let's we go got on. We do then. Charter. May 13th, Doom. obviously. Doom! I'm kind of hyped for Doom. Dr. Kinda. Doom. I can't Ooh. believe Apotham didn't stream any Doom beta. Apotham, <laughs> Apotham loves Doom. Apotham is Doom. Yeah. Uh, can you even stream the beta? I yeah. don't know. Open yeah, beta. I did playing, but I don't know if you can stream it. It's sure open can. beta, so there's no problem. Well, you can! <laughs> it's open! Sure uh... you can! Oh, it's an open beta. Sure Never... you can! Mm, on May 17th, we have Homefront, Homefront so the Revolution. Oh, home man. Front. We get to take beginning. down more Koreans. Take that, you dirty commies. I'm North Koreans. Uh, Stark Arc players. Then Shadow of, of the Beast, which seems like it's a remake of a very old title. And I've seen some pictures and it looks like shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, of the new one, it, it just looks like a game out of uh, early 2006, maybe even earlier, CG. <laughs> like, a reboot. Mm. Sounds pretty poopy. Yeah. I I, like, wow. they're also remaking a game that, like, I don't... Who was who was the fan base? Like, what is there one guy like? Yeah, they're releasing it. I'm the only person <laughs> that cares. Love this game. Yay me. Same Every day, game. same day again. Valkyria Chronicles remastered. Ooh, yeah, because we need game. more Valkyria Chronicles wait, wait, re, they, re, 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 re releases. Didn't they already remaster it? <laughs> Didn't they like release this is on PS4 version, like last year or something? Oh. On PS3 they did the remaster. It's another doing on PS4. So basically yeah. you can get it on original PS3, you can get the remastered on PS3, you can get the remastered on PS4, and you can get the original on Steam. How about they release those Valkyrie uh, because they didn't release outside Japan, huh? The, the PSP Three. ones, yeah. That yeah. takes effort. No, no as we that, said, no, that just, are... that just takes subtitles. I mean, they they are making a sequel, even though it doesn't have any gameplay like it. It's more of like an action-oriented game, but it's a sequel. So, got that what going for them. I'm always going for action nowadays. Because kids don't like slow-paced RPGs. RTS RPGs. Yeah. That's for students. I do, because I do millennials. Pretty much. So for old men. We already listed the May 24th. Oh, yeah, it's, and it's, I bet it's going to be a mobile game. <laughs> uh, the Island, Dead Island Definitive Collection. Oh boy! Oh um, man! Mason, we already did that fucking bullshit. Yeah. Oh, wow! Wow! Yeah, there is. Oh, man, I did not I get into that game. Or two comes out. I actually kind of wanted to, but uh, two is actually developed in Germany. So have fun. <laughs> 
Same day, One Piece Burning Blood. I think, uh, yeah, it's a fighting fine. game. PS4, Yo, ho, ho, Xbox, Bone, and Bone. And he took a Vita. bite of gum gum. <laughs> <laughs> Summer releases. We have Kirby. Yo, yo, yo. Kirby Planet Robo Robobot. Yeah, what? Like, uh, it, that's the... what it's called. Robobot. It's oh, like uh, Robobot. Robobot. Uh, it looks kind of cool, actually. Oh, there's Kirby in a oh. mech <laughs> on the cover. Kirby. So, it, the gameplay they showed at their last uh, little fucking Nintendo thing, and it looked kind of fun. Kirby games are usually fun. so Yeah, they can't really fuck them up. Even that fucking yarn one that was for children was fun because it was so fucking cute. Um, almost we got Deus Ex. Dude sex. Dude sex. Dude sex two. <laughs> Dude sex two. Mankind Keeping United. I, w I wonder what's gonna be catchphrase for that one. Oh, uh, we'll, I never we'll have asked to wait. For this. Never asked for this. Still haven't asked for this. Still not asking for this. Final Fantasy fifteen uh. comes out in September and gets oh. for four October. Yeah. Uh, Final Fantasy Road Trip. Okay. Road yeah. trip. Oh, is a problem oh, my road trip. It. I'm getting that's it. the worst unless, part. Less bombs in early reviews. I'm gonna wait and see what people say. <laughs> well, it's the same shit. I mean, not the same shit, but you can you can guess where they're going. They, they just keep going more and more into the action shit. Yeah, it's that's pretty much that... hack and slash, basically. That's what it yeah. is. It's Kingdom Hearts, basically. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Kind of, but generally, yeah. it is like one attack, one or two attack buttons, and then it's dodge. Time your dodge roll to go into slow mo, yeah. like Ooh, type uh, stuff. You can even literally hold circle and just wait until you win. Yeah, I mean, well, you, could you could add, you could do that in Final Fantasy VII. Just keep X that's what, pressed and on yeah. attack. Well, I mean, I they played... did that in thirteen, where you could turn on play for me mode. Oh, jeez. <laughs> But yeah, well, that's I, what I mean. You can you can guess where it's going, and it's. I always say, uh, Square Enix games might be fun to play, but they're still bad games, and I guess that's just the case there as well. I, well, I played the first sure. demo, and the combat was a mess. I wish I had the first demo. I played that tech demo bullshit they put I wish out they, a few weeks they, ago. What, what they did in the tech demo, they just stuck into the original demo and said, oh, "Okay, we fixed it, made the game better." Yeah, and not that tech demo bullshit where you can change weather. Ooh, look, we oh, made God. a really pretty what graphic engine. Office. We get it; it's really pretty. But How about making the game, the game good? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so this is some. That is something I that's want kind to of see. been a problem with that series for the past few years, or not even few, past few years, for the like... past twenty years, in fact. Uh, Square Enix has always been about movies more than games. Well, it, they've they been really like that since they called company. Enix Counter. Speaking of movies, we're getting movies! And animes! Personally, and I think Final game? Fantasy never was really good. I mean, 1 or 2, yeah. But after that, meh. Mm, I don't know. And watching that anime, it was just them pulling up to a diner eating hamburgers. <laughs> and I stopped. Because it's Kojima directed. <laughs> yeah, sure. I actually saw the Final Fantasy movie in theaters. Oh boy, a Kojima Final Fantasy game. That would be just... <laughs> just <laughs> I, I, I want to see that. I want to see that. Stop I, I'm not sure I want. Russell as Cloud. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it would be a better game for sure. Crazier, but better. Mr. Oh. Stallone as Squall Ironheart. <laughs> Fucking squall. So this is something that might be interesting Whatever. for people who stream this kind of stuff, which I would love. For people uh, who play this type of faggot game. Uh, I mean, well, you have Come played on. Jackbox games. Those are hey, fun. Hey, that's cool, though. Yeah. Uh -huh. Druffle 2 will let you create and share your own question packs. No. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. Indeed. Well, I know all the answers already. And talks boner. <laughs> <laughs> if, I'm Draw trying to make dick. one for Zoart where everything's a bigger blacker Zoart. <laughs> yeah. See so, how mad he gets. <laughs> yeah, I, I am looking forward to that. Definitely. Uh, not sure about Drawful 2. Uh, is it going to come out soon or something? 
I don't I don't oh, know if there is a release date. Are DLC. If it's a standalone. Um the original was in the Jackbox party thing, right? Uh, part on one, yeah. It's on two. Jackbox one. Dude, the best everyone knows the best game is Quiplash. They should have just done more expansions that they could have made some bank. Mm -hmm. Make Quick Blast 3 or something. <laughs> Quick Blast 2. No, no. Quick Blast 3, the search for Quick Blast 2, the search for more money. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, there, um, there isn't any news on when it's going to be released, but hopefully. Breaking off, we should do more Quick Blast. It's fun. We can do that. Yay! We, sh we should, I guess. Uh, we got a I've never been able to join. Next, though. Why not? I don't know. I... It just didn't work. All right. Just Try it. doing it on your mobile device. It, it, sometimes, it, sometimes it derps out with the browser. I don't yeah. know why. Yeah. Just play I, on my phone. The one time I could join, I was on my mobile. So there's that. Yeah. I don't have the game, so there's that. So the guy host. I can host it if you want. Yeah, I don't have it either. But it's great because it's like two or three guys on V2 only, and that's all we need. Exactly. Bitter doo doo. Yeah, that's my phone telling me that uh, I have an appointment, which I don't have. You have an appointment <laughs> to stream. Uh, exactly. Stream. Actually, I do, because I'm scheduled next. <laughs> <laughs> do more Final you, Fantasy what? Adventures of Hitler. Exactly. Faggot, uh, cunt, and Hitler stream? are on a grand adventure. Faggot, cunt, and hey. <laughs> The heroes we deserve. Indeed. <laughs> so, what are yeah. y'all streaming? Uh, uh, you need to ask see. one by one. Yeah, or I'll let's go in once. order. Let's Hold see on. who we got here. Um, Antok first. Oh, I mean, I haven't actually had time to stream, but recently we have been streaming, so we're doing. Then go away. Okay. Let's... Shut up. Transformers and <laughs> Final Fantasy IX. Go on. All right. Hogan is next. Am I streaming? Question mark. <laughs> yeah, well, you've been yeah. doing Earth Defense Force. Yeah, but that's. You kind of plan. Just name a couple games you did recently. Plan a coaster. Yeah, Dark plan Souls. a coaster. But I, w I would even stream that more. But it's still in the alpha, and there's barely any options and and, and um, objects and stuff. I already did all I could. Yeah, but you can, good, you can uh, totally count on that in the future when there's no more stuff. EDF. Please. Yeah, when I get to it. <laughs> Yeah. Blaze says he's gonna stream the new Ratchet and Clank game, the one we talked about last yeah. week, and we said, "Oh, good choice, releasing it the same day as Dark Souls 3." I'm sure that's gonna go well. <laughs> I mean, yeah. that's sort of on two ends of the spectrum, though, of people. Like, yes. you know what I mean? Like, not really. It's just a remake. But I mean, like, I, I don't see. Never mind, I'll stop. The people why, that would, will play why would people Ratchet not Clank enjoy not both play games? Dark Souls. What? I mean, are they that? Ratchet and Clank doesn't make me lose all my clanks when I die, so I don't, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> you clank. Ratchet, Ratchet doesn't get brutally stabbed and has to restart every 20 minutes. So. Are you sure? Yeah. Maybe I remember a different game then. <laughs> well, well, you just have to get good. <sighs> Then next and Ratchet, is Ratchet and Clank. <laughs> next is Jinara. I've been streaming FF9 and uh, filling time with Descent, the space game, which was recently released. Uh, elite, right? Space. Was it Elite? Yeah, it was no, Elite. We're actually not playing Elite, or no, it's not Elite. It is Ascent, mm. the space game. Ascent, oh. the space. Oh. oh. Okay. The it space game? game? Yeah. Yeah, it is literally called Ascent the Space Game as a subtitle. Okay. Yeah, what about I that know. game that happened upon that on Steam? Like, what about that game that had that long ass tutorial that nobody wanted to watch? There's several, but the the <laughs> one in space, the like like Junara streamed it then he got bored of the tutorial so he stopped streaming it and it, <laughs> until he finished the tutorial. You mean space? I no, 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 no. That was like, like, three hours tutorial or something. Space Cowboys. Reminds me of Nights in the Nightmare. 
for the DS. Play Space Cowboy we Online. It like that was two, great. Uh, two or three months ago, I don't remember that exactly. All right, so two or three months ago, huh? Let well, me I'm going to play online. That was like three hour tutorial. <laughs> oh, three hours. And what are you streaming, John Fan? I'm still doing the Zelda marathon, <laughs> and Zelda. I will Zelda. And I will be streaming Star Fox on Friday because I pre-ordered yeah. it. Oh boy! You think it will arrive on time? The store. So yeah. Oh okay. Even when I pre-order from Amazon, they just come the the well, day. I'm gonna preload so. it and stream it at 12:01 on Thursday. So oh. fuck you. Can you even preload no, from the? Yeah. Is, is it even you can on the actually. Wii U store? Yeah, it is. I was yeah. uh, up. I hadn't plugged in my Wii U in a couple months, so I updated <clears> it uh, <throat> yesterday, and that was the first thing. It was like preload Star Fox now. Oh, you can actually. Wow. Okay. But I bought the disc, so. No, I mean I'd rather oh. own the disc too. I get it. It is scheduled. It's on the schedule next week. Yay! Fuck yeah! Because I get off at one o'clock. Speaking of Zelda. I was considering doing Link to the Past because I never played it ever before. And it looks you fun. should. It's a good fucking game. Yeah. Man. I have never finished a single Zelda, Zelda game. game. Mm, I wish actually Neroth just got a, a 3DS streaming uh, capture thingy dingy. Yeah. I was oh. jealous. We could do Link Between Worlds if I had it, but I don't have one because I don't feel like shelling out fucking... Uh, if you send them a system, it's like 200 bucks. If you just buy the system, which is easier, because I think they're in fucking Japan, it's like 500 bucks. Wow. But isn't like 3DS region blocked or something? You They they have the option for any 3DS. Like you can get an E1, you can get an American. Uh, they mod your 3DS to catch her. Yeah, so either you can send them yours and it's 200 bucks, and or you can buy buy one straight and then that adds the price of the thing, so 300. Yeah, and you, could, you probably will be have to you will have to pay customs because yeah. Yeah, I think so. So it probably Depending, adds like another yeah. 150 or something. something so like Zafo, what are you Sorry. streaming? <clears throat> well, I recently streamed World of Warships. That's <laughs> filling the time. Play, do you stream that all the time? Well, not all that recently. Like I did, like two or three recent uh, streams recently yeah. in the morning when no one was streaming. That game in a while. <laughs> and what else? Been doing some Fallout, and I'm not. I'm not gonna stream Dark Dark Souls because there's enough of that. <laughs> yeah, I streamed it a bit and uh, stopped. This and now I'm doing video games, and, Dark, and Souls, Dark Souls, Dark Souls, and Dark Souls. And by the way. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I'm the asshole who put all the schedule for Dark Souls up. Yeah, that's okay. And, uh, I thought it was funny. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it was actually kind of funny because every time I pop in, everyone was playing Dark Souls. And yeah, it it's not like it's not like you were. Wrong. <laughs> I think there was rarely a time that it was up and there wasn't a Dark well, Souls stream. Oh, well, yeah. and, and other thing, I hope that tomorrow my English copy of Dead or Life Extreme oh, Free will boy. arrive. So Ooh, prepare I... for that. Of what? Game? Remember to schedule that because I want Dead to be Alive there. Extreme Free. Oh, Extreme Free. Oh titties. boy! I need to be there for reasons. Will this game be better than fucking uh, Ninja Titties? Yeah, no. I need. I need to there for research. I don't think yeah. it's better, but the titties like, the are just hell? more titty. <laughs> Isn't Extreme the thing with just volleyball and all the shit? Yeah. Yes. I so bought one. Point? People play Dead or volleyball. Alive beats volleyball for the volleyball. Yeah. I did. <laughs> no, I played for the casino. <laughs> I did. Then you are a sad, sad man. <laughs> well, I know. Well, I, the, know. Where, well, I played the Japanese version for it, and it has like a lot of pretty fun mini games and wardrobe malfunctions happens a lot. Yeah. Oh boy! It has one where you use your breast to crush beer cans. <laughs> Or right, you maybe does it. You're like you're on two platforms and you like ash ash hit each other and you like you try to knock each other off. Yeah, and, yeah, bot, bot bottles. <laughs> I do that. Me, me and my bros, we go to the beach and just bang asses together for a while. It's great. <laughs> so, what about you, Yarmulgan? What are you streaming? Oh, thanks for asking, random voice Nobody from asking. out of nowhere. Oh, Nobody oh. <laughs> hey, Pluto. Anyway. <laughs> 
I have, I've been streaming a bit of Dark Souls 3 as soon as I got it, because why not? Mm -hmm. uh, but I've stopped because Final Fantasy IX came out, so I've been so mostly know. streaming that. I just started, really. And I've done yeah, a couple too. of streams. Steiner. So, Hitler, you mean? Hitler. <laughs> He's called Hitler, and it's already paid off so no many wonder times. I, I, I was streaming <laughs> it the other day, and Zappo, I was like, what should we name him? He's like, Hitler. So he would have been double Hitler. You it's double perfect. Hitler. It's, it's yeah, perfect. yeah, actually, the name for Germ Steiner, to name, to, the idea to name him Hitler was mine also. So. <laughs> I figured. <laughs> no, pro Final Fantasy protagonist, Hitler. Dylan Milstrom. was going to be called Faggot no matter what. <laughs> And oh, as soon as I can God. rename Garnet, she's gonna be named Kant. So, <laughs> nice. that. Vivi is always Orko because, yeah, you know. Hey, man, not, we must go save. Exactly. I really hate Orko. I keep forgetting uh, Iko exists because she's a lolly. Oh, that thing! Yeah, she was. She's not a very memorable character. Yeah, yeah after the, the first four, I like to use the first four characters the best. Echo and Kaina, yeah, pretty much. Quina, Kaina, just like, what? Oh, I forgot those characters existed, because you never used them. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Well, also, nobody remembers Amaranth. Nobody uses him either. I because you get him so late that you pretty much Last character are like, you, get, you already yeah. have my perfect party. What the fuck? Yeah, actually, uh, my party for beating the, the, the hardest boss was... For, for beating the hardest boss was uh, Amaranth, Steiner, uh, Vivi, Garnet, obviously. and Zidane. Steiner with no Vivi. What's yep. the point? Well, the point is that Steiner has his own attack that does 9999 damage. Yeah, he does have some good late game attacks. He doesn't need Vivi, to be honest. But Vivi is so cool. He's Do we go through everybody? Did everyone say what they were playing? I believe did we did. Not? So. I'd say this is all for the news. Air Don't quotes. leave because oh, yeah. Warm is playing oh, yeah. Final Fantasy. Oh, yeah, wait, 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 wait. Remember, when you get Queen Anne, name her Gordon Ramsay. Gordon. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you, only have, you only have eight characters. Eight characters, so Ramsey. man. Ramsey. G Ramsey. Yeah. Uh, Ramsey, okay. I used to call G the, G to name Ram. her Shoggoth. Graham. Graham. <laughs> Name name her name her shit character I'll never use. I always use Queena. Fuck you. I she never can, use. She her. can actually be really good if you oh, get her. The magic right is skills, great. Like, it's never so fugly her. looking. Only when I like, had to look sure, whatever. Doesn't matter. Her trance is pointless. But other than that. To her, I think the game's even like. I don't just use Queena for, for for the blowjobs. Oh yeah, look oh, at that. Wow, she can really <laughs> swallow you dude. whole. She's really good. She well, can move well. that tongue. All mm, right, now that we've gross stream out, none of them are going to stay and watch you play FF9, yeah. After, not after this. <laughs> not, right, not right now, you don't. Uh, yes, you will. All right, this is all for new Zcast. 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 So, do you guys play you the flash? or not? Oh. I don't care. Fuck you guys. I'm gonna play some <laughs> Final Fantasy IX. I'm gonna stream you it. Want to schedule. I'm gonna I do play have one flash play. later. Yeah, let's play later. And I'm I gonna take that. a buff. Nope. I'm gonna go watch that. So Are sweaty. you gonna stream that? <laughs> Are you streaming that, Zafo? If you want to. Yeah. Sure. Why not? What's that tiny thing between his legs, mommy? That anyway, should be a penis uh, on a normal human being, but that, I'm not that, just not leg. sure here. Sort All of right, a man. Anyway. Got Cloaca. Like All right, V2. See you possibly <laughs> next week for another new cast. News cast. cast. Vote for Big TF. No. Which won't be new anymore. Definitely stream. I'm watching you sleep. For three hours. <laughs> yes, yeah. I've actually anyway. been napping a lot recently. I need to see a doctor about that. Yeah, you do. That's a good Bye. time to end stream. I remember seeing a... Goodbye. Bye. Bye. I, I usually Bye. get sleepy when, when Nautilus starts to stream. Haha. <laughs>